Hi guys, my name is Agent Pat and the season has reset in January 2022. So we finished in Mythic rank. So the season we set in Platinum Tier 4. So that tech for today is Historic, Best of One, Just Sky, Lotus View, Gambit. And the preview of the card, if you haven't seen my Asurisk uh, Lotus Field, then uh, the preview card is this. Lotus view. So it's a land that has hex proof and it entered the battlefield tap. So when it enters the battlefield you have to sacrifice two land. But Lotus Field itself can tap for three mana of any one color. So it's break even if you sack two land. But we don't want to sack the land and that's how we're gonna cheat our way out is two cards. The first one is strict proctor and this one that when a permanent entering the battlefield cause a trigger ability to trigger counter that ability and let it controller pay 2 which we are not gonna pay the 2 for sure and this will counter the sacrifice 2 land ability of the lotus field making you having a, a 1 land for 3 mana and that's how you cheat on mana and if you don't have big proctor on the battlefield you can in response to the trigger remember to press control full control you can strike for here to counter the trigger ability of lotus field which is the sacrifice of two land and that's how we cheat on mana here now just remind you that uh if we don't have those two cards it's still break even right because you're getting a three mana from one land and you're sacrificed two land so it's basically break even roughly but it coming to the battlefield tap yeah and then uh to cheat even more is to untap that land and here we have Tuffery, Hero of Domaria. I think everybody knows what it does. You basically draw a card, the plus one, draw a card, and then uh, at the beginning of the end step, you untap two land, which if you untap two Lotus Field, you get six mana. If one Lotus Field, you get three and the additional land. But uh, just remind you that the Big Daddy Tuffery here untap at the end step, right? So you can cast instance on your end step or instance on the opponent turn. But here we have playing to uh, Baby Tuffery, Tuffery who slow the sunset. This one, the plus one ability, which untap one target land, target creature, and one target land. Here you can untap only one land, which is if you untap the Lotus Field, you get three mana. But the good part about this one is untap immediately during your main phase. So you can untap and cast another Pain Walker or Sorcery spell. And uh, yeah. And not only that, we are playing uh, another Pain Walker in uh, Gideon of the Trial here one. So this one, I want to you to look at the last ability, the plus zero, you say. You get an element with as long as you control a Gideon Pain Walker, you can't lose the game and your opponent can't win the game. So this one, you only need to trigger one time and as long as you have Gideon on the battlefield, you, you cannot lose the game ever as long as this pain walker is on the battlefield and uh, this one combo with alchemist gambit so this one you want to cast for only three mana to red and one colorless take an extra turn and then at the beginning of the next end step you lose the game now if you have gideon with the emblem of you cannot lose the game at the end of our next turn we can't lose the game so it passed by and then you get that free extra turn for only three mana so this one is better than a run of epiphany in this deck but just make sure they can't kill the gideon in response or else you will die from this ability and then uh, the same one is chance for glory this one also take give you an extra turn and you can and at the end step you lose the game just like gambit without the cleave cost but this one is an instance so this one you can do it in response if you think you want the uh, extra turn as a instance a surprise this one is a sorcery right but alchemist gambit here if you don't have a gideon on the battlefield uh you can pay it for seven mana and you get an extra turn for free without any downside now Another way, instead of having Gideon on the battlefield, you can pay this for 3 mana, take the extra turn, and at the end of your next end step, 
when you're about to lose the game, there will be a trigger ability coming up and you can strive for that ability as well. So this one can be used on the you lose the game part of this gambit as well to cheat on mana as well. And uh, another combo here is a uh, strict proctor, right? It uh, counter like the trigger ability of any permanent entering the battlefield. And another one is Croxa, Titan of Death Hunger here. So this one has two triggers. The first trigger is that the opponent discard a card, right? This one will counter as well, but you can also have the ch choice to pay two mana if you have mana available to to not counter it, to not counter the ability and uh, force the opponent to discard one card. And then you don't pay the two mana for the sacrifice it unless it escape right so it basically is a two mana and you get a six six creature onto the battlefield we're having to pay the escape cost or without sacrificing it so this is another way to sheet mana so we're playing everything unfair basically that's why this deck is the question why do you play fair right and then you're still playing uh one heart heartbreaker horror and uh one shark typhoon all great, all great card, Ahmed Charm, Unholy Heat, and one pack of negation as well. Just in case they, <laughs> they try to kill Gideon in response to this, or strike for in response to the you lose the game of Gambit, or chance for glory. So this one has a lot of combo here, and uh, we're not playing fair at all this, in this deck. We have all the stuff. Yeah, and uh, we're playing best of one, so don't, don't mind my sideboard too much. But uh, yeah, let's go check out the gameplay. So this will be the first video for 2022. Uh, I started my YouTube in November, around November 2021. And for the, that two months of the year, I got uh, 37 subscribers. And I would like to say thank you very much for all 37 of you. I celebrated every subscriber. Like I, I won the Rotary basically. And I also thank you very much for every people who watch my video as well anyway if you like my video consider subscribing anyway let's go to the gameplay thank you uh, untap.gg agent bad profile with historic just guy lotus gambit lotus field that is and uh, here we got a win rate of 82 percent with a match record of nine and two and uh, because in january 2022 the season reset here, as you can see, it because you finish at Mythic, you're gonna be uh, reset in uh, Platinum Tier Four. Yeah. Hey guys, so this is the YouTube analytic, and uh, as you can see here, that I start my YouTube around November 2021. So for the two month in 2021, I got around 2.2k view and 38 subscriber. Thank you very much for everybody who subscribed to my channel. I celebrated like I won the lottery basically and um yeah so for the 38 subscriber you are my my 13.3 percent viewer and uh, not only that that people who subscribe I would like to say thank you to everybody who watched my video or 2.2k view thank you very much <laughs> okay uh, historic best of one So yeah, so the season reset, so we're in Platinum Tier 4 with just Sky Lotus View, right there, but with red this time. Okay, I think our hand is pretty good. We can pay Drum Island to Strict Proctor into Lotus View. Bob to the Dome, okay, so is he playing a... Uh, Red burn. Keep. Cross not. So it could be the green white human, so angel. Or the life gain, it seems. 
So if the life gain, this is a very good card. This, this card right here. It shut off all the sky cave operation and everything and turn on our lotus field. So if I get to untap with this on the battlefield, we're gonna be golden. Just let me play uh, one lotus field. And yeah, shut off the life gain too, unless you wanna trap the treasure. You want to, that's fine too. Treasure for a counter and a sky. I take that. Okay, so. I mean, it's so tempting to actually uh, anger the god, but I'm gonna need this to get my Lotus view on the board. And uh, pass the turn. Seems like they're gonna be able to get. Oh, but they need to pay two. At least you have a one mana. If not, I might pay Lotus Field into Anchor of the Gods. That would be great. If not, right now I have five, I could have six. Okay, come coming through. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Decline. And let's do one damage. Boom. Perfect. But now they turn on all the enter the battlefield. Maybe they're happy. But uh this is the combo right there. Okay. And here we are, that's fine. Okay. So let's see what we find here. Or do we want to get this down? I think we we have pack. I think we can draw a card here. Okay, that's good too. Hmm. Yep. Two mana left. Okay, now we shut down the enter the battlefield. This one not only good for turning on our lotus field, but also shutting the whole life gain deck right here. Here they can pay the life, they pay two mana, but it's gonna be a slow process for them. So here they're gonna get to counter, which is very good. fine to me. We're gonna draw a card here. And hopefully we find some Gideon or Lia action. Yeah, Lia would be good. Still drawing a bit blank here. Ooh! I'm out. Here yeah, I think it's better not play around. Take this out. Thank you. Thank you. But they sky to the last turn so they should have something good here, right? I think I have so much mana here, I might use pack if it's something like uh, the Boon Dancer or Scary Oak. Here, do we care about that? I think I want to keep it. I want to keep this for a while, have to buy some time. We get to draw a card with Tafari here.
So I think in this meta with the green white life gain squirrel deck, scary oak deck, I think, and even the human deck, this is a MVP straight proctor. It shut off all that creature unless they pay two mana and yeah, and turn on my lotus field. So good in both attack and defense. Okay, best of one historic with just guy lotus field. And here the land is not very good, no red, but we have I go first too. I think Mulligan. Okay, much better hand. Yeah. Do you want the good to free or the bad to free? Or baby to free, I mean. I think let's keep the the mana cost the cheaper one so here we don't have double red for the anchor of the god yet so let's see okay oh nice now we just need a lotus view Do I shut down your deck? It's gonna be, oh, okay, white beanie. And perfect. Now. Yep, have the turn. I don't think I can block anyway. This one get plus two, plus two if you put something on them. And it's gonna be out of anger the god reach. So I'm, um, I'm sad about this Jeffrey. I think I'm gonna need that one to be honest. I could have put this back in the library. So bad decision by me there. Vigilance. But Gideon could come to the help still. Okay, where of God would be nice here. Hmm. Not the card I was looking for. Hmm. I could kill one of them, which could be good. I would like to use the album so I don't have to pay for this but uh, yeah no choice here sorry I can't afford to play it. Okay. At least that will, they will have to tap out for it. Okay, and they can take one out. Which one do you like? Hmm. So yeah, if I have go if I go back I would probably just keep the the big tapery. So here I'm, I can dig. So here I'm going to have to dig for a web. Could have used that last turn. <laughs> so three, four, five, six, not enough. 
this one not enough too. Hmm. So let's play iteration first. Okay. Just what we needed to have a chance maybe. Let's see if I can block. <laughs> I just need to jump for a turn. I think we're gonna have a chance to find what we need. But if I jump, I can't pay the Lotus view. Ooh. I don't think I can let them draw too much. Let's see, five, I got two left. That could be a long de decision, but I just have a... F okay, still can jump it. get the token this one which could be useful to keep our pain walker alive okay okay I think I will jump take your pick okay I'm gonna jump Anyway, oh, I gotta pay my debt. Oh, <laughs> still have it. So, here, let's start with drawing the card here. Okay, that could be useful. So, here, do you want to draw a card? Do we want to untap? So, I have to play this for sure. Ooh, I forgot to untap. So let's draw a card and see what's up. Nothing useful. Boom. Okay. Let's see if they're gonna set this straight away or what? Because this is blue. Ooh, they're gonna be drawing a lot of cards here. Yeah. So Day of Judgment will be our good out. Okay, draw your cards. Hmm. So I can do this for four, but I don't think that's a use for that. Okay, let's do it for four then.
to a land. Walker alive and still have the shop token alive as well. Okay. Okay. Still no use. So let's start with drawing cards. Okay, that's good too. Let's check it out. Okay. So let's draw some cards here. So here I can actually kill one, three and a six. Yeah, I think I do that. Okay, get rid of one, and then we remember we get the. One and we can draw a card and we get the extra turn right here. Okay, this is interesting. Okay. Oh, I can do the same stuff. Nice. Oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> okay, let's not get ahead of our hills. That's six, that's three, that's only nine. So here I think I'm gonna lose this one, unfortunately. They still have a whole grip. Hmm. Could be very greedy. Yeah, let's try it. Let's see what we get. Iteration is a good draw. We can get three more looks, and that's what we need. And we get Tuffery back, which is excellent. That was a good choice. But we're still not out of the wood here. I would like to keep my 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 top for your life so let's see if we can draw a card here and i think oh gideon is also good here but oh my god i forgot i, d I don't have untap anymore oh i should have got a gideon but never mind Guess I have to make do with this and hopefully they don't have any more creature. Okay. I forgot I thought like I could get Gideon as well. It's unfortunate, but I have one counter spell. Okay. Expressive iteration, the best card in magic in my mind. So if you're playing blue red in any format, expressive integration, full set, four off. Okay. So oh, do they have a creature? Okay, good. They're gonna be tapping out. This is excellent. Ooh. Tricky, huh? So here I'm gonna let them draw a card, that's fine. We can respond. So 
good. I can even seal it if I want to. But I don't want to. Oh, anchor seems good to me. That's the turn, and we're golden. So here, let's just. No nonsense, gain the turn. Attack here. Anchor the god. Everything you wanted. Uh, let's gain, even gain some life here. Boom, top feature, top plan. And we want to draw a card. Find something useful and expressive iteration. It's what we always need. Okay. Ooh, all of them are quite good, but um, yeah, let's get Leah. Let's get another Lotus. Because we're gonna get a uh, decline, don't forget that, and then untap out. Okay, wait, let me attack first. Then let me untap my creature and my lands. So here I don't want to pay Leah because I have two counter spell, and I <laughs> remember we cannot counter spell with Leah here. But we can draw two cards and gain control of a creature and everything in the graveyard. Dog is fine. We can even steal it. We have nothing to sacrifice. So here counter. I thought we were in major trouble there. This is good. So hopefully they put a lot of enchantment there and then I'm gonna steal them at the end of that turn right there. <laughs> it's gonna be mine. So what, you need 27? So this can be my lethal damage. I have five damage on board and I'm gonna get this three three to be my final damage. Game control. Wow, nice, nice. So that's not gonna be my uh what I have Leah here. <laughs> Take my pick. Ah, oh, that was a good game. That was a fun one. That's a one historic. Just guy Lotus View. And here we got all our combo pieces. This is this could be a good start for us. So here. Question is: Do we want to pay Proctor and risk it? I think not. We don't need to risk it. Okay, that's good for us. So if one blew up, they can't do anything. They can gain your life, no problem. Oh, they didn't even gain the life. Hey, we got five mana. This is how we drew it up. Ooh, I think it's gonna be a night life game. Let's let's a 
that close. Hopefully they don't have the combo pieces at the ready. Do you think they have it at the ready? They have, we could be in big trouble. Oops, sorry. Iteration I meant. I need the Kiran or do I need the Lilia? At this stage, I might need the Kiran instead. I might caught, I might catch them off guard and play Kiran and uh, Gambit. Okay, hopefully they don't have nine life. Okay, <laughs> not combo symbol. So here your artifact. Okay. Immortal Sun. So player can activate Pain Walker at the beginning of your draw. You step draw on a cast spell on the last creature you control. Okay, sh shutting off my Pain Walker. That's fine. But I got my combo at the ready. Sorry about that. Get the elm pen. Elm And let's see how many... Okay, one, two, five, that's six. Okay. Definite taking turns. Now I'm just thinking what can I do with this? I guess nothing, so let's draw some card then. Okay. Here yeah, I think we can kill them. Super friend, guys. Super fan taking turns. Okay, great. And here we can get another turn. Okay, let's untap. Tap here. Oop, I forgot about the Gideon. My bad, I'm sorry. <laughs> my bad, my bad, sorry. So I choose red, oh well. I guess I'm gonna just choose something. having some fun here yeah? so here let's draw a card you know what Clear the land that's the creature attack them okay. like this they jump it Turn anything for fun. Draw card. Yep, just keep taking turns. Uh, 
thank you for letting me play. I would like to say thank you to the opponent. Thank you very much. Oh, whatever. What? Yeah. GG, thank you. Thank you, opponent, for letting me show. Yep, this is basically everything this deck want to show you. Gideon, uh, Big Daddy Tafri, Baby Tafri, Hallbreaker, Croxa, Strict Proctor, everything you want to see in this deck, right there. Lotus Feel, of course. Okay. Okay, uh, best of one historic. Okay, so here we have nothing to do until turn three. I think I'm Mulligan here. And okay, I think that's fine. We just need to draw some land here. We don't have black mana here, so I think. But it could be very good. But okay. Let's play a bit safe. In case we don't draw back mana. So hopefully here we can play we can draw Lotus Field, that would be the best one. Okay, Proctor gone. Gideon gone maybe. So next turn I can keep the Proctor in my hand and get Tossies or I can play it and maybe get Fighter Push. Fatal Push. But here because I got the expressive iteration, I think I played this one. Should be good. Black doesn't have ETB that much. Black red. Okay. Yep. Okay, um yeah, hopefully uh, draw into some land. Some lands. Okay, that's a fail. So here, let's hide the. Yikes! 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 So that was t three card from the expressive iteration, and still no land, no land in hand as well. And now they're gonna take my expressive iteration. I can still cycle this one to try to find some land. But not good. That was life saving. That was life saving. Um, past the turn. So I got five mana now. Another Lotus Field would be absolutely bronker. Sorin. Um, sure. Did we forget to hit last time? But never mind. It's one for one trade, I guess. Okay. So, instant sorcery, I don't get a enchantment. Do I want that? But next turn I can do it for a 3, which could be better. Hmm. I think it's... Yeah, I think it's safer this way. Your hand, do they have another Tossies? I need my Leah to survive. Okay, so let's go for Leah then. At least we get the Soaring out, out of here. So that was a good move to Unholy Heat it at, the, at that turn. Or else we won't be able to play this line and get rid of Soaring. Okay, now I hope you don't have some Q spell. So this is 6 mana, I can even do this. Hard cast, maybe. 
Black Red doesn't have anything to get rid of enchantment, so if I play this, I could be very safe. But if I manage to untap with Leah, I'm gonna have to play my graveyard before it get killed. Okay, two lands. That's great. Ooh, they can um, they can animate the back land right here. But still, only getting one uh, iteration. That's fine by me. No kill spell. I don't think they have a kill spell. Okay, let's see how many instants they have. Two sorcery. They need two more to turn this on. Two four four. So land pin on the sorcery. Yep, they don't they don't have delirium, so they can't unholy hit me. I mean delia. Okay, that's fine. That's certainly fine for me. Acceptable. Oh that's very good. Very good draw. Um this two can be great as well. Yes. So this one I can take cheat on the extra turn. Let me show you. But before I do that, let me cheat on mana a bit. So here I'm gonna untap my no mine. Let's untap my lands. And let me hit first. And play gambit for three and try for the lose the game at the end of my turn right there so make sure I stop it so I have nothing here so here I can hard cast this one let's 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 see what's on top Ooh. also good Oh, I don't have Gideon for this. I can play 7 mana for that. That's fine, I guess. 6, six 7. No, I cannot. Nope, cannot, cannot. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, so... that case, I'm gonna... Draw a card then and then tap my lens. Oh, that's great. Oh, I play my land already, unfortunately. Um, so here, I'll tap with Leah. And don't forget to strike for my trigger. Make sure I do the right one. And I don't lose the game. On tap. I can do this for three if I need to. I can even strike for something if I need to as well. Oh, I have strike for. I could have get the 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 gambit again just now. But never mind. Tapper is <laughs> is good enough as well. Yeah, I could have played the gambit again and try for the next turn as well because my Leah is on in play. I keep forgetting about that. Inkuslik, miss. So I feel a concession coming out. So here they have three sorcery. They can put one to make it four four. But I don't need the strict character. I just need either strike four or factor. Ooh. Here I'm gonna discard the land. That's fine. Oh, actually I should have um, chop typhoon. Then see what I draw. Yep, that was bad. But that's fine. Yeah, I think I can still draw. Uh, make that 3 3 and uh, double block. Yeah, I could have discarded that land. 
That's unfortunate. But I still have my Leah and my two plane walker. Not sure how can I lose from this position. Yep. Okay. Fighting number three. Okay. That's of one. Historic with just guy Lotus Steel. Turns. Yep. So we can play this and then when we get to untap, we can strike for the the black cat at the beginning of that turn's end step you lose that game we can strike for that ability and keep ourselves alive so here we are actually looking to strike for our lotus field but we have to be careful against control deck because if they counter our strike for we're, we're screwed so you think you, you you guys think they have um mystic uh counter spell Remember to, to press control if you can try for it. Yep. Or else they won't give you the choice to counter it. No mystic dispute please. If they have mystic dispute, you can uh, maybe just concede. <laughs> so here we got mana for Kropsa. With two to spare. Nah. Not very really good choice in both cases here. Ooh, grab creature. So this one, you can't let creature card from the graveyard to your hand. So I guess we're gonna wait. Here, yeah, let's pass the turn and keep counter spell up. Yeah. So this one you have Proctor out, we don't have to sacrifice it, we don't need to escape it. And that's the turn, that's fine. Typical control was control. Okay, we got our Proctor. And we're gonna choose our timing. No need for that, we want the lens. And that's the turn. So this two is a combo right there. And let's see if they're gonna open some window for us. Maybe they're gonna untap player land. Uh wait, hold on. We can steal that, but um let's not because I don't want them to play a land, untap and play um toughery. can take a couple of damage, that's fine. Okay, uh, yeah. Let's keep it hidden for now. Ooh, they're quite aggressive with this stuff. I guess we're gonna take that 2-2 two -two then. If they're gonna be aggressive with that tapping out. They still have another counter spell. Let's see if they want to slam top three. That would be great for us. Without the mystic dispute, that is. That's fine with us. Oh, it's fine. That's the turn. That's a good draw. Let's see if they're gonna steal us <laughs> we can do it for quite a lot actually six that's fine okay that shut off india Hmm. Okay, let's put 
draw. Okay, let's. Hmm. I want that lotus. But there's a huge t chance they're gonna have counter spell if I show my hands. But, uh. Um, if they kill in response, it's still break even. We can sack to land for it, I think. It's fine. We, we also have counter spell if we want to, but we're gonna be tapping 5 next turn, which we have more than enough. So, yeah, they don't have the chance to respawn. And yeah, this is the good part about that, they, they can't kill it in response. That's the time. That's fine. And our 1 3 will keep that 1 1 at bay if you want to. So. This should be fun if I get to untap with Trick Proctor. Yeah, I'm gonna let them play it. We can play the Chalk Typhoon for two if we want to. Yeah. Ooh, that's a good card. That's a good card. Do you want to counter one? We might want to. Let's try it, let's see. I just want to know if they have counter spell. No, they don't have counter spell here because it was instant. It's almost 100% they don't have counter spell. So here I'm gonna do this for two. Just unfortunately with all that mana, but I'm gonna have to kill Naset. Yeah, I'm gonna have to pay the mana. Boom. I could gambit here. Actually, let's try gambit here. Yeah. Okay, yep. Because they don't have counter spell, let's kill the Naset in the air. Okay, we have, we can do it three times if you want to. But before we do that, let's bring Kropsa out. And yeah, let's make sure we. This one is. Okay, we want to pay for the second one here. Am I doing the right one? You want them to discard one. Wait, wait. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Just play for one, please. This one, uh, is hard. Decline and they and here that's what you need to do <laughs> make them discard, but we're not gonna sacrifice That's what we want And here we're gonna pay another turns Yep, we're paying is it turns? No more, no need for more control here And we're gonna hit them for three Pass the turn Jesus Let's hit them for another three <laughs> We're actually running out of turns here. Okay, so here we get another turns here. Okay, we need to draw something or else they will get another chance. Anything? Even a burn spell would be nice. Yep. Well, I asked for a burn spell, I get a burn spell. And look at that. Great game this one. Okay, so yeah, we are climbing the ladder again after the reset. This is January 2022. 
and we're playing just guy lotus field this is a fun deck so i hope you enjoy it so if you like the video uh just like and subscribe thank you very much for watching agent bat out <laughs>